Hello everyone, welcome once again to our video tutorial. So in this video tutorial today, we will continue what we have uh, done uh, in creating a free website. So this uh, video tutorial today is we will create a free website without any purchase of uh, extension or no need for you to have a developer. Uh, you can have it, uh, when you, you can do it on yourself. So, uh, no need for you to have programming skills. Uh, so here, uh, we have here uh, a Joomla website uh, installation. So if, if you check our previous video here, we have installed uh, here, if you see my mouse here, uh, how to install free Joomla website and free hosting with a subdomain. So we have managed to install this in just 10 minutes of the video. Now uh, we will continue this one. Uh, we will continue. So check this one out first. Check this video first. And then uh, this is the part two already. While we need to customize our uh, video, uh, we will make a blog website. Okay. So uh, before you understand how we ca came up here, uh, I suggest that you need to check this video first uh, from our previous uh, tutorial, okay? So, because this is already part two. Okay, now uh, let's go ahead and uh, uh, let's modify this site that we have done and we will create a blog website. So, if we go to our administrator here, this is our administrator here. Let me close this first. Normally, uh, you'll end up through here to administrator okay so this is what you have see so i will i will i will close this one and uh to give you idea how we go to administrator so this is our site just uh, click in as administrator okay so then you'll have this uh, uh portal here the home dashboard now if uh, you are new to Joomla, I suggest you install the sample data. So you have two options for sample data here. Uh, if you want a multilingual site, like say for example an English or a French site, so you can use this one. Or if you have different language, so you can use a multilingual uh, site. But if you use only one English, then uh, you can only use this one. Now. Let's try to install the sample data. It's a sample uh, blog. Uh, if you look at here, our front end, it's totally empty right now. So I just click it here to go to the front end, okay? So now let's install uh, sample blog data. This is our guide, actually. Uh, if you are quite new, if you don't know how to start with Joomla, so I might suggest you install the sample data so let's go ahead and install this one and uh, yes and now it's uh, you can see it's loading here so now it's one out of four all right it says sample data installed now let's go ahead in our front end and let's check and compare what uh, is been done so you have sample data here for your Joomla so you have already uh, a guide how to change it okay later on we will change this one uh, how to change this one uh, I think we have separate video also for this one you can check that out in our uh, previous video as well so you can check how to change everything here in a sample data so if I go back here for the first tab that I have it's empty and now it's you have here sample data okay so uh, now since we have sample data uh, if you can see it's a uh, uh, all sample here now we will try to customize this one and uh, let's make it a bit wider if you can see so you just simply go to system and then uh, site templates this is our template here 
Cassiopeia. So just click that one, default. And uh, click on advance. Uh, let's make it uh, layout uh, fluid. So this is fluid right now. Let's try and save. So once you save it, just every time just click this one link so that you can compare what you have done, the previous one. So it will open a new tab here. So here it's become fluid, it becomes wider as you can see. So if you compare here, so here you have a space here, but here in the new one for the fluid settings, uh, you know you have a little bit of space here compared to the previous one now uh, if you don't like the color of this one there's also an alternative color uh, by the way if you don't like the whole color or there's a separate video to this one how to customize but if you want like a simple way to do it uh, just go here to the template and then uh, just uh, this is the color theme just choose alternative and you can upload the logo also here uh, okay and uh, now uh, here uh, let's uh, click alternative right and then we have saved the style and let's click uh, refresh our site let's see what is the difference Oh, I think I did not click save, so I uh, forgot the uh, alternative, and then click save. So, uh, you can also close some tabs if you want, if you don't want it to make it uh, many tabs on your browser. And then I click uh, refresh, so now you have like a color uh maroon so so everything is in maroon so if you can compare it to the previous one it's blue but now it, you have it a maroon color okay so let's close this some other tab because those are old settings that we have and uh, and now you have a uh, uh so to say a sample data that is in different color now, uh, we have separate video actually to, to how to change this layout and these images, so you can check that out. But now at least uh, uh, you know how to how to how to make a blog website. So if you uh, if you wanted to change the whole thing, you can go to the content, and then you can click on categories here. So here are the blogs that was already published. So these all things, the blogs that you can see uh, here are all here, like millions of websites are built on Joomla. So you can see it here, actually. If, if you click this one, read, read more, and you will find the category Joomla, written by Joomla. So here, this is the category Joomla click this one and then there is a Joomla this one this is the category uh, that it was uh, 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 added okay so uh, now uh, let me close this one and show you the articles here the, because we are in the category so if we click articles and uh, you can click here uh, if you can see here written by Joomla category by Joomla so and a million so this is the one if you see here this is the one yeah see so let's write uh, to test override this so if, if you are new so just override over write the sample data okay so simply like that just uh, delete it okay so let's just uh, save it 
uh, save and if you want to, to here if you want to refresh this one let's wait for this one to finish the savings so this article save and then that's the time you can refresh it says override now of course you don't want uh, your blog to be written by Joomla so what you need to do is uh, close this one and change the users Let's manage uh, not this one you can go to content articles millions and you can uh, choose here the author options uh, let me see also here created by alias Joomla so let's say you can create this uh, alias uh, uh, let's say Peter okay and then uh, you can save this and let's uh, wait now it's saved now let's try and uh, refresh so now it's written by Peter and uh, if you want to change the category as well it's quite so simple is you go to just close this one here and go to categories this one so I'll put this uh, since personal experience so personal so I'll put it personal blog so you can delete this also alias here it will auto generate what you have written from the title and it will auto generate to the alias so just click save see so it was auto generated and then you go back here and if you refresh this one now you are in the category personal blog okay if you want to change the uh, logo here of course you need to change it uh, if you want so just go uh, to what we have done earlier system site template style click Cassiopeia and you can change the logo here okay so let's say uh, for now uh, the brand let's see this is the logo title alternative logo so it's what's a personal blog so if you click save here then uh, let's uh, click refresh so it now is changed to personal blog okay if you don't want to use the the image but of course you can upload some image here if you want so this is I would say personal experience yes then I just click save save style now let's do a refresh to compare so it's personal blog and then personal experience there you have it you have your own uh, blog and you can change everything to here the rest of uh, uh, the rest of your questions let's say how to create a user how to register we have it in our uh, previous video so if you have time you can check our site uh, for uh, the previous video so you will have all the tips and tricks here we have uploaded some of the tips and tricks and tools that you can use is free uh, and uh, no need to purchase anything and you don't need to be a website developer or programmer to create a website you can create your own website for free all right so thank you for watching and uh, see you in our next video tutorial uh, and more tips and tricks thank you for watching bye